Hello, everybody, welcome to the episode of Let's Play! Fire Emblem Gaiden! Last time, we went through Silica's side and, well, got ourselves to the Lost Woods, defeating the Duma's Gate and heading into the Doom the Duma's Bog. And we're going to head in starts with all Tell me. Uh that freaking moth. Anyways, we're gonna head into Alms Route, and if you notice, huh, that's what, that's different our powers. It's different from what well, he was originally. Well, Alm has promoted no longer the regular the regular soldier. He is now the hero class, boosting all his stats. Well, should boost all his stats, but it didn't, so he's just net so now he's a bunch of new animations and a shield. So we're gonna head over to Zeke and well face off like with him. So, head into the Regal Plains. And there's two groups of enemies, one blue! Because we have Tatiana on our side. If we didn't have Tatiana, it wouldn't have worked. Oh, where's all our soldiers? Anyways. What? Tita! Tita was saved? Very well. All troops, engage Jerome's men! Zeke. Huh, that guy looks familiar. <laughs> ah, Gold Knight, too. Huh, that's weird. We have his lances, and it has a pretty high stats to boot, and, uh, hmm, I can't shake the feeling we met this guy before. Hey, anyway, yeah, all of, all of his men <laughs> uh, have actually joined us, and are gonna attack Jerome, who is not that d difficult of a boss, so why not, uh, hmm, who has the- okay, so we have Clyde- so who did it give us? Because we have all of them, we, okay, so we have Tyson, we have Matilda, Matilda's so good, we have Silk, Gray. Luca, probably? Or is it Force? It's Force. Uh, and Robin. Uh, why don't we warp Matilda into the middle of them? Because why not? Actually, why not Alm? Warp Alm. Let's, let's just, I just want to show up Alm's uh, sprites real quick. Just to show up the sprites. I won't. Oh, so he also Alm has bows now. Uh, by the way, let's just show off Alm. And crit. <laughs> Any uh, cradle hit immediately. I think he just looks, he looks cool. Side flash, and he also gets a ton of XP. But I'm not gonna actually do that. I just wanted to showcase that off. So let's move up forward instead. Uh, just let you know, Zeke's men will basically cover almost every single one of the uh, well, yeah, of the battle because they will actually slaughter through Jerome's men. You just need to make it too so that the battle doesn't end up with, with him dead. You know. Uh, I could illusion, but I'm not going to because you know, I just uh, make things a little bit harder for us. Why tired? Why tired? Alright. Alright! End turn. You're gonna attack uh, them, so. They're pretty well d uh, done. There's, oh, oh wait, no, his forces are very much outmatched. Holy crap, they're all paladins versus they're all gold knights. All right, and Zeke's gonna attack. If you keep Zeke alive, he should be fine. Zeke though is a, one of the strongest characters in the game, so he should be very fine. The only problem is his men are very much dying right now, very quickly. There's one down. Alright. So let's head in Clive. Take out some one of these guys. Do you have a new horse slayer or do you have a silver lane? Oh no, you have a magical seal currently. So poop poke poke poke. I and uh bow knight up for Python. You move over here, Python, you shoot critical hit. Killed him immediately. Nice. Nice. Alright, shoot that guy. Miss immediately. Okay. Send Gray in. Gray will take out this guy. Or try to. He'll, he'll do nothing, but. He'll anger the enemy. So let's move you in, Matilda, and help you. Okay. Okay, Force! Force Uh, I'll warp you in. Uh, warp, warp, warp. Warp, warp, warp. Okay. Warp, warp, warp. Zoop. And poke you. He missed. Of course, Luck. 
take it. Anyways, okay, wait, and we'll we'll see how this goes out for them. Probably not too well, but we did clear a lot of those soldiers. Okay, you'll basically throw yourselves at the enemy. Uh, you'll throw yourself at that guy. Nice, but no, what the hell? Okay, bow knights. Alright, so, we have Clive. We can... Okay, we need to use a bow knight to take on that guy. Okay, let's fight up against uh, that guy, I guess. Okay, there we are. Robin killed. And that's HP. That's HP, but hey, he doesn't need it. Alright. Gray. Slay this guy. Try to. Just damage him really bad. Okay. Baron, you poke. Poke, poke. Nice. Alright, Python. Does this pro do magical damage? No, it doesn't. But it does do a lot of damage. Like from fire, for one. Basically, a Parthia. Alright, I beat the Parthia, honestly. <laughs> okay. Matilda, you keep the Holy Lance and just poke. Okay, keep it jousting, keep jousting. Okay, and now let's, uh, move Luthier in a bit. Uh, that was a mistake, because I just realized you can be talked by the Gold Knight. Anyways. Okay, let's warp you in now. Alm. Face off! And now, um, you kill. And you don't double, but. Oh no, you do double. Great with your flashing animations. You bastards, please! And a level for all. Nice. And level 2. Skill, speed, HP. I'll take it. Skill, speed, and HP. That's nice. Alright. Alright. And battle. I should be here, because of course you will, and you're gonna, you're gonna run away. And you're gonna hope to end that seeks gonna tar target that guy, not let that guy run away. <laughs> no. No running from, from me! Down you go! Alright. So, uh, you take on this guy. And nice job, Gray. Power, HP. Respect it. Respect. Respect the. Respect the grind. Characters. Alright, and now move you here, stab Matilda, you poke him. There we are. And that's the enemy down! And Jerome has been conquered! And now we can now move into Regal. A village. You guys saved General Zeke, eh? I thought I ha though I hate Zephians, I must thank you guys! Okay, here. You're all the one who saved Tita, aren't you? Thank you, kind. General Zeke, you oppose this war, correct? Please join our cause! I cannot. I only helped you fight Jerome, because he made my people suffer greatly. Besides, I don't know who I am. All I can remember is that uh, I washed up on Thrigel's shore. To my pitiful self, His Majesty Rudolph gave me a new life. I will not betray him. I understand. Apologies for my rudeness. No, not at all. Hmm? Oh, what's the mark on your right hog? Mark? Oh, I've always had this birthmark. What is it? I see. His Majesty Rudolph once told me. Zeke, if you find the one with the cross-shaped birthmark on his right arm, you must dedicate yourself to that person. He will certainly become the savior of all of Valentia. If this is His Majesty's will, then so be it. Um, I shall fight with you. And we got the Gold Knight Zeke. General Jerome was a cruel man. Even this village was sacked until Lord Zeke came. General Zeke has no memories of his past. Lady Tita, fa uh, Tatiana found him on his watch ashore and with an awful wound and nursed him back to health. An awful sore wound? His head is Dragon Mountain. The zombie dragons there will tear you apart. Hmm. So let's give the bio on Zeke, shall we? Zeke. Don. Don. Da -dum, dum, da -da 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 -da. Zeke! <laughs> uh. Oh, sorry, that was a display. <laughs> Oops. Zeke! Uh, past unknown. Totally not! <laughs> he's a gold knight with the lan with lances, and, uh. His inventory is a lance. Uh, nothing else, but he. He has. Well, yeah. He'll be the per the wielder of our other lance. The one that we, you know, need. The silver lance, maybe. And anyway, he joins the Amargalian village. He's level three, nine movement. He's from his nationality is actually Grustian, 
Uh, he's actually not from, again, he's not from Raquel, he is an honorable personality. Recruitable, save Tatiana, fight Zeke, then top of all. Uh, his growth rates are pretty darn good, and he starts with pretty good bases too, basically being an upgraded Matilda. Honestly, I think it's interesting how you get all the tiers of, uh, units on, uh, of Cavalier on home side. Okay, old, but, yeah. Again, and by the way, if you couldn't tell, I put his real name over there in the top corner. Uh, <laughs> I think we can all tell who Mr. Zeke is. Hmm. Washed up on shore with a grisly wound, who looks exactly like another guy who has the exact same voice as this. Voiced by Patrick Seitz. Anyways, uh, and is, uh, a very honorable person. With gold hair. And has no memories. And even even more obvious when you play Fire Emblem on the NES and fight the actual character. If you couldn't guess it by now, it's Camus. It's Camus. It's him. He's alive. He never died. Yeah, he got he basically got slashed and uh, and fell into a river and gets wa and basically washed into the middle of the sea and somehow floated all the way to Valentia. Lucky guy. I mean, his luck is four though, so I guess those are the one good bit of luck he had. But yeah, Zeke's alive, uh, Camus is alive, and he's amazing. Also, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move, maneuver my uh, team around. Uh, rank, move Diet, Diet, replace it with, with uh, Zeke. Pita, replace freaking Luthier. Uh, Claire, replace, Chris Forsyth, and Cliff. Uh, Cliff, you replace, uh, you keep, actually, you stay there, alright, then we have a good team for now, though, we have Teats on our team, right? Yes, we do, okay, two healers, and as we head north, across the water, for Gal Valley, just checking if there isn't any, uh, items in the village, you know? Yeah, scroll, 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 making sure there's no items in the middle of which. <laughs> Alright. But, yeah. But yeah, he's- it is- but yeah. <laughs> Anyways, let's head back. So, yeah. Let's head out to the Dragon Land. And, but, before we head through there, I will actually be going through. We'll actually be doing something unique. We'll be doing two areas in one. Two. Well, we were cycling to both of them. Because guess what? Next chapter, next mission is Alm, Alm, Alm. Only Alm. It's Mueller, uh, Magnem, and also Rudolph himself, who is apparently a cavalier. Anyway, in this game, versus the Baron. Anyways, so let's head into Duma's Tower. Yes. So welcome to Duma's Tower. Oh hey, two things on the both sides. One's luck, one speed. We need speed. Yes, who needs speed up? Actually, let's set up, let's just set up our party, because this is the final time we'll be using this party, so... Okay, wait, no, 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 units. Okay, so, if we want Jenny, we want Dean, we want Saber, we want Jet. we do not need Jesse. We do need... we do need Atlas. Jesse, compared to Atlas, is, is better. We need all three of those. Bowie, we don't really need Bowie. Uh, but Bowie is pretty good. But he, he's like a backup healer, but, but also... You know, I might bring in Jesse. And also, let's swap, uh... Item swap. Take the Seal Sword, and give the Silver Sword. There. There we are, and also, I guess, give that. Okay. So, let's now move to Duma's Tower. So, who needs speed out of our group? Speed, 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 you're good on speed, Silica. You need speed, Jenny. Dean's good on speed, you're good on speed, you're good on speed, S is good on speed, Jess is good on speed. Mio, Leon needs speed, Paula needs speed. Paula! Paula does not double anything. They're the slowest unit, so Paula. Which come really handy against those flying enemies, which you can double for. And now we'll also give Jesse some speed, I guess, or Leo. And the power wanes, so it means they can close their mouths, meaning that we can't get anything else. Anyways, head north. Where the frick is our army? Alright. 
So, can we have pass? Let's go to me. Okay, we got this enemy. She is the best out of all of them. But yeah. Okay, move. Okay. These are dragon fighters. Uh, Saber and Atlas. So let's go to Atlas at least. And those are mean, so he does pretty, pretty good. Atlas slays everything he touches because this was nearly capped out HP and strength. <laughs> Imagine if there's a, a triangle attack for dread fighters. That'd be cool. Too bad it's not possible. But anyways. And then we have Dean, so Dean should. Okay. Power? I'll take the power. I'll take power. Alright, you move here. Okay, you need five range, so I'm just gonna wait. Okay, you're attacking. Okay. Now. Oh, magic skill HP. I'll take it, and now you're dead. Move you one. Actually, what are we doing? Move closer, and then you use, uh, illusion. Oh my god! <laughs> Alright. Hey, you'll attack. Boop, boop. Basically fodder. Again, fodder's good for something. So yeah. Speed up, because it's gonna take a while. Seriously, I'm, I'm scrolling. I'm looking- I'm not even looking at the screen right now. There we are. There we are. Now that the mission- that part's over, let's, uh, hmm, Dean, how much damage do you do? 21. Versus your 20 defense. You'll do 1 damage. Oops. So you do 21 as well, so, hmm. Uh, Dean, you attack. Hopefully you do enough damage at first. Alright. Uh, Jenny, you use Angel. Do enough to that. And Jenny levels up, getting luck. Yeah, that's not the turn Good. Skill speed. He <laughs> can run again. Okay, then. You move closer. Uh, Excalibur still. And you move closer to stab. Poke, poke. Okay. No, nope. Okay, can you climb this or you have to. I don't know how to open that. But, anyways. I'm sure you'd use your lore, but. Oh no, they open it themselves. Okay, thank you for attacking the things. Aren't important. Okay. Attack! Attack my soldiers! Attack my pretties! Attack my pretties! Okay, uh, let's use Ragnarok and wipe, we wipe out the floor with this guy. Fireball! And you double too, so. Alright, and I don't double, so. Okay. So, Falcon Knight moment. Uh, doesn't. You missed twice, thanks, game. There, finally. You move closer, and you equip Nosferatu. Nice. Okay, stolen HP, but Jenny leveled up again, getting magic and HP. Nice. And you, uh, one shot on Saber. Nice. And Atlas, you get the hit on him, because Atlas will absolutely destroy him with his HP. With his strength and and turn. He'll defeat the useless enemy. Okay. And then they have all the stuff will just throw themselves at him. So who needs the kill? Okay, you don't need the kill, you don't need the kill, you don't need the kill. Dean could Atlas needs it. Okay. So let's use Saber for right now. Get the pin down, and now the kill will be Atlas's. Nice. 36. Three skill up. Alright. And High Knight conquered. So now we just have the tower still. Tower needs to be a couple battles. So. So. To the right is a thing of skill. So, who needs skill out of our four? So. Out of basically these three. Who needs skill? Say Data, Silica, Skill 12, Skill 12, Skill 20, Skill 20, Skill 20. Okay. Silica needs skill. Jenny doesn't really need skill as much, but Silica does. Alright. Head up again and get into another battle! Well, that's four separated. So, this is the worst possible group thing. I was gonna say that. Okay. And 
uh, fire, I guess. Okay. Actually, you two are fine, because I can just use Angel on you. And wipe you from before. Okay. Where is... Okay, how much damage do you do? Okay, Dean does pretty good. I probably should wait. So, you know, you do your thing. And Saber, you attack with your Silver Sword. Okay. You attack with your, with your Hero Sword. Okay, and then we wait. You're gonna attack Jenny. Jenny will attack. You will attack Dean. Dean will attack. Dean will attack Saber. Saber will attack. Okay, and now you will use your other angel to kill this thing. There we are. Now we just fight something against them. Just end turns. Okay, boop, boop. Boop. Okay, and final hit. Drop slash. And then you tap the head. If I knew it was like that, I probably would have swapped in one of the. Well, one of the sisters, so. So, now you know. Ah, Dean Slash. Okay. Alright, and there we are. And the bonites are conquered. So, on top of here, we want to actually move uh, Est, Paula, Patria back to the top. Up here is... Okay, I actually used it. That would have been HP. Which we don't really need. These ones up here, we do. That's why I moved in Paula S and Catcher, by the way, is take on these things. These Draco zombies. Would have annihilated us if we didn't. So, wipe out that one. Wipe out that one. I could... Hmm, I could have S to take on the... Do that, and then move you there, so then you can't attack. You have a bow, don't you? No, you don't. So now you can't attack Silica. Okay, okay, I'm mine. Silica just wipes him out. Okay, skill speed. And then we head up one more level. Yep, that was it. And now we have defense and power. So power is probably the better of the two right now, because we have pretty tanky units, so we have characters with very little power. So let's give power to some more characters. Hmm. Beta, right now. But yeah, this is the end of Silica's party round, by the way. Alright, power. Silica, probably. Defense is needed more. On May. But I'll give power more on Silica. Power. And head inside to meet with Jetta. I've been waiting for you, Princess of Sophia. Who are you? I'm Lord Duma's top servant. Jetta, head of head of the priest of our Lord. If that's so, then please, I beg you, free Lady Mella! <laughs> what a what a panic you're in. Look into the, this crystal of mine. You missed seeing that face. You dearly must see that face, yes? That's right. It's all. Why don't I let you watch him struggle? Alright, so... Let's move into the... Well... Into the Dragon's Crater and we'll end the episode. So... You'll basically shake, and we'll be cut off. And the dragon zombie will basically attack us. Maybe we should have jumped dragon zombies to deal with, which won't be too bad. We can take care of them pretty easily. Then we'll closer. Okay, we're, we're level to a point where dragon zombies aren't really that much of a threat, so these guys should be pretty simple to take out. Cliff. Problem is, we don't have angel or anything. We just have spells. Actually, no. You want to... What's your move range? Okay, you have eight, so you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. If 
you move here, you also have the ability to move here. So, hmm. Wall time. Okay. Wall. 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 You might come in handy, Mr. Bowman. Let's land again and turn again. Line the in. Alright. Okay. Stab Luca. Stab Luca. Nice. Alright. I might warp a character down there. Mainly you. Warp. Warp you down there to help with the foes. Okay, you guys can take down those two, but one will have to be... We'll have to take down you. Okay, Claire, you focus fire on that one. So... Baron... Okay, you focus. You will use... Excalibur, probably? Okay, it's twice. Okay, there we are. There's one down. Skill, HP. You use Aura. Uh, hey, you use your strongest spell, probably Excalibur, or Arrow. That works pretty well. Alright, now there's no more foes over here, there's these two guys over here. So, we already have the Blessed Bow Wielder, so we can use that to take down this guy. So that's that guy down, and then we'll use Alms, Physical Strength. Actually, let's show Alms Bow animations. Real quick, just to show up the animation. Yeah, it's not that good, but yeah, it's pretty cool looking. Let's use your physical strikes to take on this, zomb this zombie. Dragon, move you back. Fire at you, and crit. I guess Robin conquered it. And yeah, that's the zombie cave down. We can't move either, so we're stuck. Hmm. So yeah, we're stuck here. So yeah, we have to basically be stuck here for a few turns. So... I think two? Is that it? Okay. Three. Three turns. We basically just struggled here for a while. Alright. Which good as we are... Sh Actually, before we do that, swap around, uh, okay, let's swap Diute and, and, uh, Claire. And swap Tita and Luthier. Alright, now we have to rest. There's zombie dragon, but even more zombie dragons, so they are gonna move down and down. This way, and they're gonna attack. That's the uh, Tita. Right. Tita's still alive, but barely. Alright. Claire's gonna take out one of them. Why not? Alright, a lot of stats, because then, of course, it's gonna give me a lot of them when I'm about to lose. Alright, and you, uh, Excalibur. You fear or are you uh cleft? You're cleft, okay, good. And you move in the middle. Alright, you should be fine there. Alright. Zeke. I probably have to be open. Right, Zeke. And Matilda. We'll attack Cliff. But fine for now. Uh forgot to guard you. Alright. Cliff's fine, it's fine, Cliff's fine, and of course. Undo save state. Okay. Alright. Of course it was. 
Alright, how much is your accuracy? Not that much, but it's even this is of course. I could do this, but that's just gonna, just gonna make it so you're gonna angle pack. Okay, I could do that and poke ya. Okay, I could do this. No, but you still attack is the problem. I thought that was the bottom of the map, and that wasn't. So... Hmm. And you're gonna stab, but it's hey. And you can get lucky. And have it turn where you don't hit. Just freaking miss! That's all I say. Miss! Miss! There! And then you use Angel, because of course you do Oh wait, we have a warp character. Undo save state. Undo save state. Okay. Okay. I can warp a character there. Uh, warp, 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 Matilda, Matilda, Matilda. Still, but that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <sighs> okay. Why did I? Oh my god. Okay. Okay. Good thing we have a couple of revival springs up. But we also are blocked off from it. Okay. What's we can get? Okay, maybe I can get lucky and miss twice. I want that one to call it Angel. Okay, lucky, 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 no. Luck, luck, luck. Okay, fear back when I get lucky. Oh, maybe this one? Nope. Fear back when I get lucky. Alright, I'm just gonna kill it and just... And just use the revival spring after this. So, yeah. Just fixing my tabs. Anyways. Alright. Use the revival spring after this, apparently. So, we still have- I also try the animations because screw it. Try to move the Try to move the mage out of the way, and I end up moving the mage into it, of course. That's right, that's not how it works, apparently. Step forward, two steps back, apparently. So. So, yeah. Alright. Okay, go please. And you run away. And you block the way. Not again. Okay, I'm about to take out you. Okay. Alright. Got lucky. Alright. I'm really sad about that, actually. I like Tatiana, she's like one of the best healers in the game! Anyways, what should we do? Rest again. Again, we just entered the one guy area there, and now there's even more dragon zombies. So... Unknowingly, I actually move. Why do they all go here? I don't understand why they all move over here. Okay. Okay. You move this way, Luca. Look at that. Poke him. You keep running. Poke this guy. Hey. Move Tyson, you move that way. Luca. You. Ah, uh, sick. Okay. You warp. 
Matilda, this way. You stab him, her. The dragon. Alright. Use Seek his bait. His wife's dead. Cliff, don't die either. Why do you all go after the freaking... God. They all go after him, them. I don't understand it. I don't understand it. You do. More bomb. This way. Need as many uses there as possible. Get as many of these guys as possible. Okay. To create a box that he can live. Okay, Claire got that kill. Oh, I'm gonna kill this enemy. Luke is gonna kill this enemy. Undo save state. Alright. Here. Okay, move you here. Move Alm up here. Okay, and move Scylla, uh, Matilda here. This time I'm actually having a guard. And then you attack them. Run this way. Alright. Again, we get access to the revival string brings after this, so we don't have to worry too much about them. Okay. 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 Undo save state. Okay. Freaking healer. Got the healer. Okay. Ah! I have two revival springs, so I have a way of doing this twice. So, so if he dies, I have a way of doing undoing it. Okay, that worked. Doing's okay. Alright, you're gonna attack her. You're gonna attack him. You're gonna attack him. You're gonna attack her. Okay. <sighs> sucks. It just sucks. You know? I really don't like this area. Okay, I'm gonna be completely honest with you. This area is kind of poopy. Right. Uh, sword. Yeah. Okay, there we are. And then I just use repel. Bison. <laughs> Zilica, arms trapped on death mode. Arms trapped on death mode. Follow me if you want to save him. If you sacrifice yourself to Lord Duma, arms path shall again open up. All right, so we only have one way to do this. Follow Jetta. And we're in this mysterious area. Hmm, that's weird. Head south and in through this gate. Can't open that gate yet, but we're heading south and around here. Right? No? Out of here. Speak to Jetta. And we have warped into the final battle. Yep. 
But Silica's unit is trapped. <laughs> so you're finally here. This is Duma's altar, a site of human suffering. Thus, I shall kill you slowly and painfully. Your pain will be Lord Duma's magnificent feast. Alright, and now we can actually escape. Problem is, the, dra the dragon will come back, but we can actually escape and, and revive Tatiana. Yeah. We'll come back in force. So, next time, let's play. Next time, we're going to, well, clear out the finale of the game up until the final battle. See you guys then.